heat and ironically enough coming into a kitchen where you would imagine it would be brutally hot as well but not today because Super Jenny well known as being sort of farm to table healthy eating clean eating is showing us about gazpacho which are cold Absolutely. soups and I'm a little bit of a tough sell on this because I'm worried that, that part of the soup is that hearty warmth right. of it and I've never made gazpacho so show me how it's done. This one is super easy anyone can do it um, you just start with some fresh peppers uh, you can use any color and you know I'm not a great recipe follower I like to test things as I go That's along true. so I'm gonna let you pour these all things right. in. So we've got green peppers got and red peppers. Green peppers and red peppers. Next thing all we need is some cucumbers and while you do that I'm gonna dice up some tomatoes really quick. These are locally grown tomatoes. We've got tomatoes, cucumbers and your peppers. Next thing we're making this a little tropical right? Ooh, I like that. So we're going with some fresh pineapple. So that gives some that. sweetness. Yes. And then we took a mango. And if you don't know how to cut your mango, I like to just score it. My little secret weapon is I like to use V8. Because I'm not the gazpacho person. I don't use any oil in ours. So V8 is just a little bit spicy. It's got all your vegetables in it. It's got the sodium that you, you want a little bit of salt maybe. It sort of um, does the work for you rather yes. than just tomatoes. Just tomato the sauce. tomatoes. Okay. Oh, we forgot one important item. Go ahead. The cilantro. I, I was wondering about that. So herbs, that's a huge part yes. of something like this, so, right? The flavoring? Yes. We're going to do a little cilantro. And cilantro, you can eat the leaves as long as it's clean and the stem. Oh. So the stem is not tough. And I literally just wow. taken a whole thing in there. <laughs> Gonna let you taste it, and then you can that add so salt. Easy. And I mean, look how that is. You can chill this. This I do this at home, and I'll put, you know, grilled shrimp on top of it, lobster, a um, piece of grilled lobster. It's just great. You're Perfect. right about that V8 juice, giving some of that spice. Yeah, it just to gives it. this little touch of spice without adding any oil, so this is fat-free.